This morning on AM Buffalo, we are catching up with seven first alert meteorologist Michelle McLeod because she's going to look a little different on TV today. And we are going to see that first. Michelle, I love your hair. You are probably used to seeing Michelle look like this on set wearing a wig. As of today, she is going natural. After two years, it's, it's time to just be who I am and be authentic. Why do you think historically it's been something that particularly black women have wrestled with? Do they go natural? Do they wear wigs? And you know, the fallout one way or another that comes from making that choice. <sighs> well, so I've been natural. Like this whole natural movement is relatively new to the mainstream. But I've been natural way before it was cool, and I find that it's really interesting because I'm getting a lot of backlash for being not natural in here, wearing my wig. And when I was natural, I got a lot of flack for being natural, and a lot of people being like, you should wear your hair straight. So because of conventional beauty standards, I think a lot of people feel that pressure to look a certain way. What did I hear? It's a powerful when you put your oppression on your head. And for me, not wearing my hair straight years ago, I didn't want to participate in that but then I would put the swing on my head and I kind of felt like a fraud. Um, I felt like I was putting the oppression on my head and how could I, in good conscience, be proud and represent for the children that are watching me and, and wear this. And so going to the schools and seeing kids that look like me while wearing this oppression on my head and being um, a figure that they could look up to, I just, it just felt wrong and that's what made me decide to uh, go natural on air. I was already natural off air, but on air, having a platform and um, having some kind of influence and having people look up to you, it was important to be a good role model to show people that, any people, that it's okay to be yourself, no matter what you look like. Why do you think people get so caught up in how someone chooses to wear their hair? I think people get more caught up in how a woman chooses to look in general because um, there was, I forgot where that anchor was, but he was wearing the same outfit. He was for the whole year. Yes. Whole up, no one noticed. Anything we do with our looks is heavily under scrutiny because we're women. Go to Annie. <laughs> Today, Michelle frees her hair and. How do you hope the reaction will be? I'm super nervous. I am afraid, I'm afraid people are gonna be upset because it's different. And they're gonna be like, I wish I liked your hair better than the way it was before. But I hope that it's received openly and warmly and that people are happy about it. Um, and if not, at least I know that I'm telling the truth now and I can go to sleep a little more easily at night. Catch Michelle McLeod's seven first alert forecast today in the news at noon.